This is Chapin Student Media, and we interviewed Delilah Flores, the girl who did the solo at the spring summer dance. She's been dancing ever since she was seven. Uh, I hope I get to do more solos. It was fun. I liked it. It was a cool experience. Um, so every show's different. Sometimes we'll do themes, sometimes we'll just do a showcase, but I always like making them as diverse as possible with as many different dance styles. Um, so just through the creative process, even if we have a set theme or know what we're going to do as far as genres, it always changes. Um, it's just part of the, the creative process, so you always have to be willing to adjust, readjust, and then do the whole process over. Honestly, it went by pretty fast. It was pretty fast paced, but uh, we practiced for a couple of months. All of the dances that we had contributed, or we already had um, known them. But the new dances took us a little bit of time. Uh, like I said, it was really rushed though. So in the spring show, I did give a little speech to all my classes saying that they need to keep, keep the same high energy that they had in the fall because in the fall it's new for them. In the spring, they already have one show under their belt, so sometimes their energy levels dip. Um, but also just going through that and practicing keeping them up and still giving a great show even though they already have one under their belt. Uh, I've never done a solo before and I think that's why I'm so nervous. This is my first time doing solo on stage. Backstage within myself, I was mentally preparing myself. I was going over the dance within my head and uh, trying to compose myself because I was really nervous the fact that I, my family was going to be there watching me. So that's always a process also. Um, I can be as prepared as I can be on my end, um, but in the end, I can't do the project for the students. This is their like their big fall and their big spring project. They the students come up with most of the choreography. Oftentimes, I'll be the one who, have to, who has to jump in and help them with choreography and get them past the finish line. Oh, when I dance, I just feel like really free and really happy because I get to express myself. Um, I do help more in the fall and the spring. They've already been through it once, so they kind of know the ropes. So every show is different for this past show. Every class had anywhere from two to four or even five pieces within each class. Um, and I like for there to be a variety of dance genres, so I like to give students what they want, and I also want them to explore things they normally wouldn't explore. So I do pick some of the dance genres that kind of makes them do things they normally wouldn't do. So where I get something I want and what's beneficial for them, because it's new, and then I let them choose something that they want to do. So it's a little bit of both. Uh, I just kind of picked a song, and I just choreographed to the music, whatever. Only the captains have opportunities to do solos. I really did enjoy the lighting the backstage, how many people were also involved in the performance. I also liked the band director. Um, I always push him every single day. I know that everyone doesn't wake up with 100% energy all the time. Not everyone wakes up wanting to dance every single day. I'm even like that myself. Um, but once you force yourself to get going, um, then you're able to sail through the class a little bit better. But I tell them every day, you have to come, put in the work. Here's where all the magic happens is in the studio. You don't get to go on stage and look good without having put in the hard work in the dance studio first for many hours. Um, mainly nervous, but also kind of like relaxed because I just got to dance. So everyone's different. Uh, the more you practice picking up choreography, the more you practice creating choreography, the better you get at it. So everyone's at a different level. So that's kind of a struggle too, but we get we work past it um, because everyone's at a different level with coming up with choreography and how well and fast they learn it. Um, just making sure we all stay together because it's a group effort in the end, so we all need to stay together. Uh, our new hip hop mix, uh, there was just, everyone contributed to it. Um, everyone had their own choreography, their own little skills, and it just came out really, really good within such short time. Uh, when I was around 13, no, when I was 6, my great grandpa passed away, and I always wanted to do a song, a dance to a song. Um, so on stage, that's like my reward is seeing everything just come together. Everything leading up to the show is really stressful and I'm always a little bit worried, but I know given that I always put in my best effort and making sure the students put in their best effort, it's going to be a good end result. But everything leading up to that is a little bit nerve-wracking or a lot nerve-wracking, um, but on stage I just feel really happy and proud and they're all my dance babies and I get to 
you know, just sit back and enjoy and see all the hard work that they've done. Uh, I chose the lyrical dance because I think it's the dance style I do the best. From Chapin Broadcast, Daniela Cruz. Thank you, Shubhahu. Signing out.